Hello students, welcome back to Master YouTube channel. In the video, we have 12th standard zoology and biozoology students. Second midterm exam, we have important questions in the last chapter. First, zoology students, chapter 10, 11, 12, and 13, and biozoology students, chapter 9, 10, 11, 12. But, chapters are the same as the same. First, Unit 10, Applications of Biotechnology. If you have important two marks, mention the number of primers required in each cycle of PCR, write the role of primers and DNA polymerase in PCR, name the source organism of DNA polymerase used in PCR. Second question, explain how Rosie is different from a normal cow. Next, if a person thinks he is infected with HIV due to unprotected sex and goes for a blood test, do you think a test such as ELISA will help? If so, why? If not, why? Next question, explain why cloning of Dolly, the sheep, was such a major scientific breakthrough. Next, fifth question, name the first transgenic cow. Next, which human protein produced from transgenic cow? Next, question number 6. Name the organism used in the production of interferons. Next, why E. coli is not used for the production of interferons? Next, question number 7. Name the enzyme and substrate used in ELISA test. Next, list out the steps involved in PCR. Question number 9. Expand GEAC. Next, mention the role of GEAC. Question number 10. Name the representatives of RCGM under DBT. Next, question number 11. List out the geotagged products in Tamil Nadu. So, in this video, unit 10 is important 2 mark questions. Next, 3 mark questions. How was insulin obtained before the advent of our DNA technology? What were the problems encountered? Next question. ELISA is a technique based on the principles of antigen-antibody reactions. Can this technique be used in the molecular diagnosis of a genetic disorder such as phenylketonuria? Next question number 14. Gene therapy is an attempt to correct a genetic defect by providing a normal gene into the individual. By this, the function can be restored. An alternate method would be to provide gene product known as enzyme replacement therapy, which would also restore the function, which is your opinion is a better option. Give reasons for your answer. Next, question number 15. Explain how ADA deficiency can be corrected. Next question. Differentiate between somatic cell gene therapy and germline gene therapy. It is important on our question. Next, question number 17. One of the applications of biotechnology is gene therapy to treat a person born with a hereditary disease. That's the first question. What does gene therapy mean? Next, name the hereditary disease for which the first clinical gene therapy was used. Next, mention the steps involved in gene therapy to treat this disease. Next, question number 18. Differentiate pluripotent and totipotent. Next question number 19. What is mean by transgenesis? What is mean by transgene? And what is mean by transgenic animal? In the three questions, remember we important on our question. Next question number 20. List out the possible risk of GMOs. This is the unit 10. Important three more questions. Next five more questions. PCR is a useful tool for early diagnosis of an infectious disease. Elaborate. What are recombinant vaccines? Explain the types. Explain how recombinant insulin can be produced. Next question. Explain the steps involved in production of transgenic organism. Next question. Explain about the production of human alpha lactalbumin. Next. Illustrate the production of recombinant HB vaccine. Next, question number 27. Defend gene therapy. Explain the process of gene therapy. Next question. Explain about the steps involved in ELISA. Next question. What is PCR? Explain the process of PCR with diagram. 
Next, list out the applications of PCR. Explain the process of cloning of Dolly. Next question, what is mean by IP or mention its function? So, it is a unit 10 important on a 2 mark, 3 mark and 5 mark question. Next, we will talk the unit 11, organisms and populations. First, 2 mark question, first question, what is acclimatization? Next question, what is pediogenesis? Next question, differentiate between urytherms and stenotherms. Next, give the diagnostic character features of a biome. Next, classify the adaptive traits found in organism. Next question, what is serostress? This is the unit 11 important 2 mark question. Next, 3 mark questions. Differentiate J and S shaped curve. Next, give an account of population regulation. Next question, differentiate between tundra and taiga biomes. Next question, what is ecological density, crude density and population density? This is unit 11 important 3 mark questions. Next 5 mark questions. Give an account of the properties of soil. Next, describe population age distribution. Next question, describe growth models or curves. Next, tablet and analysis of two species. Population interaction. Next question. Differentiate between predator and prey. So, this is unit level. Important on 2 mark, 3 mark and 5 mark questions. Next, unit 12. Biodiversity and its conservation. This is important questions. First, 2 mark. Define endemism. Next question. Name the active chemical found in the medicinal plant. Rau, Wolfia, Omitoria. What type of diversity it belongs to? Next question. Amazon forest is considered to be the lungs of the planet. Justify this statement. Next question. Why do we find a decrease in biodiversity distribution if we move from the tropics towards the poles? Next. India is the greatest ecosystem diversity on earth. Why? Next question. What is mean by anthropogenic extinctions? Next, mention the national parks which is present in Tamil Nadu. So, this is unit 12 important on 2 mark questions. Next, 3 mark questions. How many hotspots are there in India? Name them. Next question, compare and contrast the in situ and ex situ conservation. Next question, alien species invasion is a threat to endemic species. Substantiate this statement. Next question, in northeastern state, the June cultivation is a major threat to biodiversity. Substantiate the statement. Next, what are the three indices of diversity? Explain. Next question, write short notes on IUCN. This is unit 12, important 3 mark question. Next, 5 mark questions. Red data book, what do you know about it? Next, mention the major threats to biodiversity caused by human activities. Explain. Next, what is mass extension? Will you encounter one such extension in the near future? Enumerate the steps to be taken to prevent it. Next question, write a note on protected areas, wildlife sanctuaries, WWF. Next question, explain about species area relationships. It is unit 12 important on 5 mark questions. Next, unit 13 environmental issues. All important questions. First, expand CFC, AQI, PAN. Next question, what effect can fertilizer runoff have on an aquatic ecosystem? Next question, what is air quality index? Next, what is colony collapse syndrome? Next, question number 5, what is eutrophication? Next, what is accelerated eutrophication? Next, what is vitrification method? This is unit 13, important on a 2 mark question. Next, 3 mark questions. Write notes on the following eutrophication, algal bloom. Next question, discuss briefly the following catalytic converter. Echoes and toilets. Next question. What are the steps taken by the central of state government to control air pollution? Next question number 11. Explain briefly about air quality index. Next question. What are the effects of noise pollution? Next explain about organic farming and its implementation. 
Next, why e-waste are so dangerous? இது இவ்வளவும் unit 13ல இருக்கக்கூடிய important ஆன 3 mark questions. Next, 5 mark questions பார்க்கலாம். List all the ways that you generate at home, school or during your trips to other places. Could you very easily reduce the generation of this waste? Which should be difficult or rather impossible to reduce? Next question, how can we control eutrophication? Next, explain the effects of air pollution. Next question, explain the effect of water pollution on organism. Next question, what is mean by agrochemicals? Explain the effects of agrochemicals. Next, what is biomagnification? Explain with example. Next question, explain the methods of disposal and how will you control and manage the radioactive waste? Okay students, it is the second midterm portion of your question. Important questions. So, in the questions, you will be able to do the same thing and you will be able to do the same thing. If you have any questions regarding your question, you will be able to do the master app. If you have any questions in the question, you will be able to do the master app. And if you have any questions, you will be able to do the master app in PDF format. So, wishing you all the best for the exam. Bye students.